starts now with breaking news. Well, we begin this midday with breaking news in just the last hour. Buffalo police say they have a person of interest in custody in connection with the Zenner Street double homicide over the weekend in Buffalo. Channel 2's Alexandra Rios Malvia joins us now with what we know this morning. Good morning, Alex. That's right, Pete. Not only is the person of interest in custody, but a gun was also recovered. Now, over the weekend, police were called to the home of Zanner Street in East Buffalo. This happened Saturday around 1230 in the afternoon. Now, this is also where police say that they found one man dead on the porch and another shot in the street who later died at the hospital. Buffalo Police Commissioner Joseph Gramalia says that these two men were workers who were hired to work on the home. He also says that two victims were members of the Bangladesh community who both had Buffalo addresses. Buffalo Mayor Byron Brown said on his radio talk show that the shooting had nothing to do with race, nor was it a hate crime. One of the men had two children uh, with a young baby on the way, and another one of the men had seven children. So these were two innocent men, therefore work, and sadly, incredibly, in the wrong place at the wrong time. And both Gramalia and Mayor Byron Brown visited the Buffalo Muslim Center on Fillmore Avenue to meet with members of the community at the mosque. And they say that they were all upset and they are now coming together to raise money for those two lives lost. Now, this is still an active investigation. We'll have more on this breaking news story and local reaction to it tonight, starting at four with Most Buffalo. Pete, back over to you. All right, Alex, thank you very much for that update.